Hey friends, Johan here. Uh, hope you like the bike jersey. My wife picked that out for me, especially for me. Just wanted to uh, update you on how things went this week. Wednesday I saw the endocrinologist. Uh, it was a pretty decent visit. They uploaded my Dexcom data from the last couple months and they said bottom line that it looked really good so whatever Dawn's been having me do has worked for the most part. Um, she's feeling pretty proud of herself and she should. She's kept me alive this far and uh that's a pretty good thing we talked about ordering a an insulin pump that i really really hope i can end up getting hopefully my insurance won't completely thwart that whole plan but this insulin pump is a it's about the size of a pager, if any of you can remember back in the days when uh, pagers were a thing. It's about that size, you know, yay by yay. And uh, you just clip it to your belt loop, you know, your belt line, whatever. Uh, and then it has a, a tube that connects there's a thing you attach kind of I mean it's not unlike my Dexcom sensor that you just kind of implant into your skin with this little thin cannula it's that same basic thing but this thing automatically gives you insulin throughout the course of the day and it also has sleep modes which obviously you don't burn nearly as much sugar when you sleep so it kind of backs things backs your insulin level off and then it also has um, exercise mode which for people like me who bike or run or do a lot of exercise type activities that's important because it can predict based on your your consumption of glucose and your burning of glucose it can predict where your glucose is going to go and adjust your insulin accordingly and that would really help me out for races and rides and practice runs and things like that so that i don't have to necessarily stop every 20 minutes and look at my look at my monitor to see where I am um, but hopefully that will become a thing I've sent in the application it'll be it'll be a couple months before it gets approved and it comes in and all this sort of thing and then I have to go get set up with a saline I guess demo where they'll just run it with saline to make sure I can figure out how to use it to make sure everything works okay and then I go back in after that for the actual insulin so hopefully within you know a couple months by July or August hopefully I will have this insulin pump then Thursday, we went to St. Louis. Well, we went Wednesday night, but we went to St. Louis for another procedure down at Barnes. It went okay. I was asleep for most of it. Basically, things are progressing just not quite enough he replaced my stents with new ones and actually put in a third 
and I go back in July for another procedure. Hopefully in July, I will get to get everything, all my hardware taken out, and I'm, I'm, I'm over hospitals, guys. I, I don't like being a patient. At least these are outpatient surgeries, and I haven't been an inpatient for quite a while. But I'm done with hospitals. I'm 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 tired of that shit. I want to be out with all y'all running and riding and racing. I'm just I'm I'm tired. But having these procedures beats the alternative so what are you going to do in the meantime today Dawn gets off in about another 40 minutes or so and then when she gets home she's going to get changed and judging from my attire we are going to go on a bike ride with the Dales and I think a few other people I don't know where we're going. I don't know even where we're starting. I'm going to guess Stewart Park, but I don't know that. But we are heading out there for a ride. And then I guess next weekend we are getting up to meet at High V at 4.20 in the morning. Uh, to do Stefan's Parkway Loop which is basically from Dirksen Parkway to Veterans Parkway all the way around the city. It's about a little less than 24 miles according to his map. I hope I'm able to keep up. I don't know, it's one thing riding with Tommy and Lori. They don't mind hanging back and waiting on my slow ass, but considering there's going to be like really proficient writers out there. I'm worried I'm going to slow everybody down. Or get left behind. <laughs> but we'll see what we'll see. The worst part of that is going to be getting up so early. I may have to call in on Monday just because... But they also are thinking of doing it again on Memorial Day morning to take advantage of the hopefully less traffic. I almost think there could be more, but perhaps not at 4 o'clock in the morning. God, that just sounds painful. 4 o'clock in the morning. I, I, Other than Disney, I don't think I've ever gotten up that early for a run. Disney you have to cuz they start at 5 a.m. and you it you it's a production to get to Epcot for to get lined up in your corral and this and that. But I'm I digress yet again. I am the king of tangents and I hate trigonometry. Anyway, so I don't know if we're going to do both of those, but we're going to try at least next Sunday to see if I can survive the, the parkway loop. It's I've gone a little bit farther before, so it's not the mileage. It's just what's making me nervous about it is just being able to keep up with everyone and... I don't know. I'm probably psyching myself out for way more than I actually need to, but that's how I roll. So, but that's where we are. And then I got another week until Abe's army starts. 
So I had that to look forward to. Oh, uh, this week I need to run a 5K at some point for the Shields virtual 5K. If I submit proof of time, then I get to be registered in a drawing for loads of fantastic prizes. So I have to do that. I will take it nice and easy because it really doesn't matter what my time is as long as I do it and get it turned in because I get the points for the participate partis partish pace screw it series races for the club and it'll be my first points of the year possibly my only points of the year depending on how things go but that's where we are bike ride today 5k at some point this week if the rain holds out maybe we'll do another sneaker run on thursday Sneaker shop run on Thursday. Next Sunday, we've got a bike ride, the Parkway Loop. Sunday after that, got another bike ride, the Parkway Loop. And then, like I said, in July, I've got another procedure in St. Louis. Hopefully, it'll be the last one this time. If not, then I go back in September. Like I said, I'm just, I'm done with hospitals. I'm tired. They take care of me really well, but God, I'm tired of being in hospitals. I work in a hospital. I don't want to spend any more time in a hospital than I absolutely have to. What are you going to do? At any rate, I got to... Get off of here. I got some stuff to do before Dawn gets home so we can skedaddle out of here before the rain comes. So, um, until next time, take care of yourself. Have a good week coming up, and Johan out.